Tools required to convert a hideaway is a Phillips head screwdriver and a small shifter. You will need to order the following spare parts, a half flush mechanical lever, a full flush mechanical lever, a mechanical lever holder and mechanical buttons. Step 1. Remove the buttons with a Phillips head screwdriver. Step 2. Detach the pneumatic hoses from the T-piece. Step 3. Isolate your water at the isolating valve. Step 4. Disconnect your flexible connector from the inlet valve only. Step 5. Detach your pneumatic hoses from your pneumatic device off the T-piece. Step 6. Remove the gauge rod by pressing down on top of a gauge rod. Step 7. Unclip the inlet valve off the holding bridge. Step 8. Remove the holding bridge, then you can remove the inlet valve. Step 9. Remove a T-piece from the holding bridge, you will no longer require this. Step 10. Remove a full flush lever. You will no longer require this. Step 11. Remove the half flush lever. You will no longer require this. Step 12. Remove the pneumatic device. You will no longer require this part. To rebuild, remember to swap your half flush and full flush levers and to include your mechanical lever holder. Step 1. Slide half flush lever over outlet valve. Step 2. Clip full flush lever on the top of the outlet valve. Step 3. Insert inlet valve and hold in position until completed step 4. Step 4. Install holding bridge. Step 5. Clip inlet valve to holding bridge. Step 6. Install gauge rod by pressing on top of gauge rod. Step 7. Slide mechanical lever holder onto brackets provided, making sure that levers find their way into lever holder slots. Step 8. Reconnect flexible connector. Step 9. Open water at isolating valve. Step 10. Wind plastic mechanical screws into mechanical lever holder. Step 11. Install wall bracket using a Phillips head screwdriver and screws provided. Step 12. Clip plastic screws into wall bracket levers. Step 13. Install push plate by applying pressure to the bottom. Hideaway pneumatic to mechanical conversion now complete.